this is how I set up the soil or the base part for small mangroves or hatchlings that I have come out right after their paper towel period. The paper towel period is only just so the umbilical cord dries up faster. So that's only for a few days, maybe a week. But after that, I introduce sandy soil just like this as my typical base. Um, you can make it whatever ratio you feel like it, but I kind of do a little bit more sand than soil sometimes. It really just depends on what I have too. So this is the base here. Now after placing just only a couple inches of moist sandy soil, I then put a, a dry medium, which is this leaf litter here. And you can feel free to use as much as you like, but I kind of cover the base a little bit. And I'm going to use this area a little bit later, so I'm going to clear that out. But uh, this gives the animals uh, something dry to sit on instead of just always being on the moist bedding underneath. And it also traps the humidity a little bit better, conserving the moisture within the soil. To really keep things simple, instead of adding a ton of hides everywhere, um, I mean, you can do that. Sometimes it just, it's a lot easier to simplify things. What I do is I'm really just making a reed stack out of, uh, out of uh, broken pieces of cork bark. And it just allows for pretty decent temperature gradients um, for what the animals want to choose. And really, it is simplifying how I'm keeping them for the couple months that they're in here. Getting situated is just a lot easier to navigate where they are and to really keep tabs on what they're doing, if I could. Um, and just something like that. It doesn't have to be anything special, but that's all I'm really doing. And that's really it. And then I put a little water dish in there. And that's how I'm keeping little little guys for maybe, I don't know, two to three months, give or take, until they get situated. But just a simple enclosure like this for small mangroves. Um, you can spruce it up, add more to it how you want, but for the basics, this is how I'm keeping them.